Greetings, comrades! I think I've is back with another episode of Shareware Nightmare. Now, for the sake of brevity, from here on out, I'm going to stick with five uh, wads per Shareware Nightmare episode, because, you know, I keep getting six or seven wads, and some are turning to be a lot bigger than I anticipated, and I don't like making videos too long, so I'm going to stick with just five wads uh, per video. So, I picked up five wads, all for Doom 1. Yeah, this one has a readme. Dante666. Dante's Gate. Alright, let's see. It's the third version of Dante's Gate, and it comes come with a peculiar bug in the Doom 1.666 engine, which is on. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay, um. Skill defaults that hurt me plenty. Yeah, okay, Z1, M1. I'll just stick with the regular, you know, just get the wad and put it in. That's how I always do it. And for the most part, it works. Dark Hell. It's got my attention. You will love these maps where I have no imagination worthy of freeware. Well, we'll see about that. So, Oh, this is another uh, episode replacement. One more, we might start with this one, actually. Okay, so it's an entire episode 2 replacement. It's like one I've come across so far. Doomtown. Apparently there's two wad files. Let's see. Talk about that. Okay, so. Okay, so two versions. The two different ones. A hundred hours each. Let's hope it. Let's hope it pans out. So, E1 M1 and E1 M2. Two replacement. Death Town. Okay. Um. Did I do this one already? I can't. I don't remember. I don't know. Anyway, grid. Okay, another deathmatch level. And pure evil. E1, M1. Okay. Well, we'll go ahead and start with the uh, dark hell. We'll see how that is. I'm curious what this, how the levels in this episode replacement look at look like. So give me a minute. All right, now we're st starting things off with dark hell. Let's see. Uh, rare episode two replacement. Let's see how it is. Okay. Looks interesting so far. Wait a minute. Have I played this one before? I don't recall if I've played this before. It looks familiar. Well, this is what happens when you're dealing with literally thousands of level wads. You know, it's hard to keep track of which ones you play and which ones you haven't. Also grab these health pickups. Okay, so the gel key door's over there. No, I don't recall playing this one, so. random rooms. Okay, we've got an invisible floor. So why not? Spheres. Okay, need another, another yellow key door. Well, I guess we have to find the yellow key then, huh? 
Yeah, um, not so sure about this one. Ah, shield. And a tepish. But let's stick with Antonov for now. <coughs> and we're back out here, okay. I got the blue key. So we can go in here at least. Backpacks, score each. This red key, okay. I didn't see a red key door anywhere. If I did, I probably won't. And for some reason, I was pressing E. Oh, it's over here. Pretty small, but hey. Surprised that he just tossed a cyber demon in there for good measure. How's my shoot that stump? Of course, keep it over here. Go through a maze of trees to get to it, but okay. A nice little cross design there. Now we can, well, for, let's go to this one over here first. Because I didn't think there'd be two yellow key doors. Jesus Christ, another random mishmash of textures. Well, uh, not quite what I was expecting. Yeah, this a uh, teleport thing. Well, I don't really see anywhere else to go, so I guess, yeah, I guess we'll go there. So, where's the exit? Um... Expected. Let's go ahead and check out the other maps. Well, they're starting out lacking on monster count. M3. Ooh! EFG. Now... Jesus Christ. Well, that explains the BFG. Super weapon. One over there, one over there, and one over there. Okay, and apparently the entire arena is a secret. Is this it? What the? <sighs> well, a little too generous to pick up, don't you think? Well, it's certainly hell, but I won't go as far as to call it dark. It's a pretty bright depiction of hell. Oh my god. This is like big crappy shit megawad before there was big crappy shit megawad. Yeah. I'm not gonna go about playing through these levels. 
Oh my god, what the heck is this? Yeah, I'm not so sure about this one. <laughs> but again, what do you expect? These are, these are the kind of maps they were making back in the day. Are you... Well, there are plenty of monsters to kill, so... I guess that's something, but... Why? Red, white, and blue here. Yeah, no, no, uh... Eight? Well, it's a tower, so... They got that bit right. There better be a cyber demon up there. Guys, yeah, where the only way up, go, the only way to go is up. Random switch textures here. Um. Okay. Well, yep. Cyber demon. And it comes out of a little. And for some reason, there are a bunch of keys here. I don't. Okay. I'm curious now. Is it? And yeah. Some episode replacement, eh? I don't know, you be the judge for this. Anyway, that's it for Dark Hell. Let's go and check out the other four maps. Alright, now it's time for Dante666 or Dante's Hell. This is an E1M1. Let's see how it is. Okay. It just starts off kind of decent right now. Like that. I'm enjoying this a lot better than the previous squad. I'll tell you that. Oh, well. That was a door, but apparently no. It's, uh, pressure. How do I get that? Get those goodies in there. Key. So if it is a door, it's just that was a crusher. What I do with that? It really looks better than the previous one. Yeah, I'm almost dead. <laughs> be nice if I had a bullet weapon. Blitz. What else in there? Why well, make the door a crusher too? Like, a okay, yellow key for that. Do I need a blue key for this door? Why would you do that? Like, why? It's up 
here. Yeah, just good pickups. I like how the Wild Souls don't make any sounds when they spot you. But I thought it was in the originals. Yeah. to be an elevator, but no, it's not. I'm gonna burn. Here, shield, backpack, wood. All well and good. Do need a way out. Let's go get the loops off. Uh... Oh, another elevator. Oh my god. Um, still no blue key. I got a BFG, I want that. What are the chances? I'm gonna super open the first map. And I did see the blue key over there, so, well, I had to go down here after all, and I found a secret. No, well, arguably should be there, but that's where the blue key is, so you kinda have to go here. How was I supposed to know what's down there? It's not like I have an auto map or anything. Well, there is an auto map pickup, but, you know. I don't know how to get to it. Oh well. Guess what we came for. Well, this map's okay. No, oh, not the best I've played. Okay. We're already at the exit. Path here. Exit. Oh, but I got bullet upgrade. Chris one had another bullet weapon. Guess not. Okay. This map's pretty decent, but I'm gonna go ahead and check out the other maps. Alright, now we're just trying out Doomtown. There's two waterfalls for this one, so I'm gonna see if I can get both running. And I just realized I forgot to get rid of the DEH file from that final uh but oh well. Okay, so oh. Yes, I played this before. It's the exact same wad. But let's check out uh Okay, I haven't played this, so apparently it's supposed to be a continuation. And as long as I don't go too far for the key. And I don't need multiple keys yet. So is this the administration office or the landlord's headquarters? Oh no, it's just another part of the Oh, 
shotgunners. You're still late on your payments. Pay up or die. Any attempts at resistance will be met with lethal force. As is typical of Russians. Okay, this is supposed to be a bar. You don't expect a bar keep to have a grenade launcher with him. But he does. Oh yeah, I came from here. Well, actually, I kind of want to go back to the other door. Awesome. Equipment. Some here. Oh, shield. Okay. Now we can start affecting tenants with explosives. Hardly the time right now. We got uh, tenants to evade because they have they've been far behind in payments. Mining wall here. Oh, oh, I see what this place is now. Okay. All it's missing is a pole. Anyway, I think I'm been there already. Ah, another bar. Maybe an American beast bro. Well, not really American, it's Phobos. I'm assuming. I guess it's supposed to be a restaurant. It's supposed to be a TV. Oh no, it's just a... Uh... Oh no, it's supposed to be like paintings and whatnot. Okay. Not too bad. I'm hoping it here though, it looks like I need a yellow key. <laughs> okay, that's not really open. But these back alleys here. Nothing here. Is that an elevator? No, it's just a. I guess it's supposed to be a garage. It's supposed to be an auto shop. See me until I walk that close to him. That's why I'm not paying last month's payment on time. Can you imagine having a landlord like me? <laughs> okay, so I need a blue key for these two doors. I'm probably not gonna bother with that, because. The exit's right here! Doomtown 1 and 2 is a f f f f former I pl already played before. I didn't know there was a continuation of it. But anyway, two more maps. Okay, now for Grid. Oh, this is the only deathmatch uh, level of this video, so let's see how they pulled it off. I didn't mean to select episode 2. Okay, that's more like it. Okay. Well. Uh. It would definitely make for interesting death matches, that's for sure. play this map exclusively? Probably not. MP40. Hmm. Well, I think you get the idea for this one. Alright, one more map. Alright, last but not least, Pure Evil. I'm curious how this is going to play out. And the person who made this is pure lazy. Though, 
might be too quick to judge there, but could have used a little more variety in the textures. But again, I can't stress this enough. This is the kind of mod we bought. These are the kind of maps that we're making back today. Remember, they didn't have Doom Builder or Slade. You know, I gotta remind myself of that. You know, it's pretty much par for the course as far as the 90s are concerned. Too much ammo. So. Okay, a little peeping window there. Get a shot of my dick. Oh, and we got a Doom now playing inside. So it's a hidden movie theater. Well, that's pretty classy. <laughs> Not sure you're supposed to sit, but. Very cramped movie theater, but hey, for the 90s, you know, an admirable effort, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine trying to go to this movie theater? Like, think of this, it's a small movie theater, kind of cramped, and you have to go through a, a lava floor in order to get to it. Like, Ask yourself, is the movie going to be worth that trip? All depends on if you like Doom or not. Oh boy. This is supposed to be. Oh, Ricky. Well, uh. I wasn't expecting to find a movie theater in here. But there you go. Boy. Well, I have a red key, but not a blue key. Oh, can't open that. Okay. Can't open it. What the heck? That door. Um... Where's the blue key at? Nothing's oh, let go! <laughs> oh, that's not it. Yeah, not quite selling me on this one. I have a red key, but I don't have a blue key. Where's the blue key door at? What's that do again? Well, um. I think that about does it for this one, because I don't know where the blue key is. <laughs> anyway, this is what, episode 17? Yeah, episode 17 of Sherwood Nightmare. And I'll have a few more videos of uh, TNT Revolution later on. So until then, I'm going to be Caleb signing out.